In this section, we are going to look at the tool called as Infura that we are going to use. Now, previously we saw how to deploy our contract using Truffle Migrate into the uh, Ganache local blockchain, right? But you might also want to understand how to deploy this into the uh, testnet or the mainnet also, right? For doing that, we were able to do it from Remix. Remember, if we go to Remix, we had this uh, injected Web3 and we connected to this MetaMask and that gave us the Web3 providing to talk to the blockchain. Good thing is this MetaMask is a uh, Web3 provider and it is online. It is connected to the blockchain because it is a light node, correct? This light node can talk to the full node and send the transactions through the full node, right? But you cannot expect, let's say some of your users to have this MetaMask already or uh, if you are using a full node, you are creating a full node for yourself in your system, let's say, okay, then you might not have it on 24 bar 7. There might not be security. There might not be, uh, you know, liveness always, right? That's the reason why we also uh, use AWS or Azure or digital version kind of cloud providers to develop our websites and deploy it there. Reason is that we can also create our own full node, okay? The problem is we cannot keep it completely scalable and uh, live always 24 bar 7 etc. These services do it. That's the reason instead of creating our own server in our own uh, laptop which is also possible we are using AWS or Azure or things like that right. In the same way instead of uh, creating our own full node we can use another full node service called as Infura right. So this Infura.io is the Ethereum API it says right so let's go into infura.io and create an account so that it gives the api endpoint for us to connect with the full node okay so whenever you go to let's say this uh, entire uh, truffle application right this smart contract if it has to be deployed into the uh, no blockchain let's say first we needed a blockchain that was provided by ganache right now because we need a blockchain it is there only in a full node, right? And Infura is the full node. So remember that Infura is a full node, which gives an API to call it and deploy our contracts and things like that, correct? So as soon as you get into Infura, you have to click on sign up and it's gonna ask you for your email, right? You can give any email you want, yeah? So let me say my email ID and then a password. Okay, what does it say? Okay. So make sure you create a strong password here and then click on sign up, right? So on you, once you click on sign up, it's going to check your mail and all. Let me just verify my mail and come back. You can do it in the meantime. Pause the video maybe. Yeah, I have verified my email and then if you probably refresh, it should show you, right? Okay, I have to sign in again. Let's go to infura.io, login, give all your details. And when you log in, it is going to take you this uh, place, right, where you have multiple, uh, let's say, uh, tutorials and things that you have in Infura. But let's go directly to this Ethereum tab on the left, right? Go to say Ethereum and you don't have any projects at this point in time, correct? So create a project, probably name it Ethereum itself, right, and create it. So this will be your first project that you have created and within this, it will go to statistics of how many API calls you have made to this Infura and things like that. Okay. Every time you deploy a contract, every time you call a function in the contract, it's going to be a API call that you're making. Okay. So go to the settings and you can see keys in here. Okay. So this will be the endpoint we need. Okay. So this will give you a HTTP endpoint. Remember HTTP 127.0.0.17545 is the API key given by Ganache. Using that only, we were able to deploy our uh, smart contract into the Ganache local blockchain, right? Similarly, we have a HTTP connection and using this, we'll be able to connect to our Infura itself, okay? Infura has a full node, correct? So it has a full node in mainnet. It has a full node in Robsten. So if you want to deploy to Robsten, you use this API instead of the mainnet, right? So this is mainnet. This is Robsten. This is Kovan. This is Rinkaby. And this is Goerli, right?
So these are the different endpoints that uh, has been given by Infura. We'll use this whenever we want to deploy a smart contract from Truffle project into the actual blockchain. Okay. So kind of important, make sure you uh, make a copy of this or even anytime you want, you can come here and get this API also, not an issue, right? It is completely free for uh, normal usage for testing purposes, etc. Right. Uh, but of course, as you increase the number of uh, uh, people using your application and making calls, you need to probably start paying also. That is later when you create a world class ap uh, app by yourself, right? Which I really think you should do. Yeah. Good then. So that is the installation of Infura and getting the API key. We'll see in the next section where we deploy our smart contract into the uh, public testnet that is available. We'll go to either Robson or Rinkb to deploy our contract.